super yogis. It's Rena. Did you recognize me? I might have a cape and a mask on because even though we're super yogis, we're also our own form of superheroes. But how do we, we don't need the mask though. And we don't need the cape because we're human super yogis. So today we're going to learn about something very, very important. It's a different kind of yoga. So there's different kinds of yogas and you've been doing all sorts of cool yogas, but the one we're going to learn today is karma yoga. Can you say karma yoga? Karma yoga. Si. Sí. Hoy vamos a aprender cómo hacer karma yoga. And what this is, is when we do nice things for people and we give back and we serve, right? When you are served, you, someone's practicing karma yoga with you. Cuando alguien te da algo, ellos están practicando karma yoga contigo. Entonces, hoy vamos a aprender cómo hacer karma yoga. Today we're going to learn how to do karma yoga. And a very, very simple way to do karma yoga, una manera muy fácil para hacer karma yoga, es to do something nice to, for someone else. Es hacer algo bueno para otra persona. Que le van a hacer cosquillitas en el corazón. You're going to have little heart flutters when you give it to them. As a thank you, como un gracias, or as any other way that can make them feel good because that means that you see them. Eso quiere decir que tú los reconoces como alguien que te está ayudando o solo porque están haciendo algo bueno por otra persona. Maybe they're doing something nice for someone else. So, if you see here, you can see that I have my little array of things to use. So you at home have things that, that you can use too. Because we're going to give something to someone else that's going to make them smile. Nosotros vamos a hacer algo para alguien para que ellos puedan sonreír y sentirse bien. So, first thing is, you might have to pause me. I wonder how long I can hold this. But first you might have to pause me and go get some supplies. So make sure you can either get some, these are some uh, color pencils, color markers, some construction paper, some regular paper. Puedes agarrar crayons, lo que necesites para crear algo lindo para alguien para que ellos puedan sonreír so that they can smile. So look at whatever you have at home, but very important that you are careful and that you get the okay from your parents. Entonces tienes que... Uh, Tienes que tomarte en cuenta que tienes que preguntarle a sus padres qué puedes utilizar, qué puedes usar. What can you use? So, I'm going to use construction paper. Yo voy a usar este papel y papel blanco, lo que quieras, para hacer, pintar algo lindo para el que me trae mi correo. I'm going to draw something for the mailman because he still works every single day and he brings me my mail. Isn't that amazing? Él viene todos los días y te trae correo. Wow! Entonces, le tenemos que decir gracias. Bueno, yo le voy a decir gracias y yo le voy a pintar algo lindo para que ellos puedan sonreír. Entonces, tú piensa. Primero, pausa. Let's pause for a moment. And I want you to think about who you're going to give this to. So think, close your eyes, sit up straight, and think about somebody who makes you smile and that maybe you want to make them smile or you know somebody who makes somebody else smile and that you want to make them smile because they're so nice to them. So close your eyes and think of somebody. Piensa en una persona que te hace sonreír o quizás hace otro sonreír y feliz y que tú quieres que ellos también sean feliz. Muy bien. Cuando tengas esa persona, when you have that person in mind, then we can start to think about what we're going to do for them. So we, tenemos todas nuestras cositas para usar. We have all our things to possibly use. And then we can start creating something together. Muy bien. Entonces, yo tengo mi am amarillo, yellow, because I'm wearing amarillo y yellow. Y yo voy a empezar con pintar algo. I'm going to start by drawing something, dibujar algo. Murmur, I'm going to use my color pen. So think about what you're going to do. Let me think about this. Déjame pensar. Él es my mailman. 
Hmm. Y yo quiero quizás, le voy a dibujar una carta. So I'm going to draw him actually like a letter. Hmm. Vamos a ver. A, a card, per se. A pretty, let's see what happens. On one side. So I'm going to make a big rectangle. Ooh, look at my rectangle. Rectangular. Muy bien. And then I'm going to draw the flap of the envelope. Ahí está. Es como un triángulo, a triangle. I added a triangle. And I'm going to draw a little heart. Voy a poner un corazoncito. Boop, boop, boop. Ahí donde dobla. Pero adentro, inside the envelope, voy a tener que poner otra cosa. Wait, maybe I should put here a little message. I'm going to put un mensaje. ¿Qué voy a poner? ¿Qué voy a poner? ¿Cómo le, cómo le puedo hacer sonreír? Maybe if I say thank you, quizás si le digo gracias, voy a poner en los dos idiomas, voy a poner thank you du, 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 y gracias. So here's in English, thank you, y en español, gracias. Just in case he speaks both languages. And if he doesn't, then he knows how to say both. Okay, now I'm going to draw, I'm going to put this away, and I'm going to... What do I use? Oh, I have stickers. Should I show you everything that I have? I think I should show you everything that I have, because maybe it'll inspire you to get something from your house. Creo que te voy a enseñar todo lo que tengo para que tú puedas estar inspirado en la casa. Quizás puedas usar algo así. Ok, so, I showed you some of the things. Aquí están, muy bien, the pet color pencils y los marcadores. Aquí también, I have my little felt tips. Remember when we use these for the malas? Woo, I love myself, I love myself, I love myself. Mm -hmm. And I have here, I have a feather, a bag of feathers. I have the bag of beads. Remember when we use the beads for I love myself? So I can like glue it on here. I can do all sorts of those things. I have, ooh, I have a bag of eyeballs. Oh my God, I have a bag of eyeballs. This is so, I'm gonna have to use these eyeballs. You know that, right? Okay, okay, I'm gonna grab two eyeballs right now. A red and a yellow. Well, yellows are, I'm already putting it on yellow. So maybe, 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 I hope you're doing this with me at home. I'm going to just put two red ones. Okay. And then I have, I have some fuzzy balls. Look at my little rainbow balls. I have rings. So look at my rings. I have these wonderful rings that I can wear. Whoa. And I can make, put the eyeballs on it if I want to. I don't know if my mailman really wants a ring though. Right? I don't know. It could be a male woman. Puede ser así también como una mujer. Entonces, tengo stickers. Mira como tengo stickers. Yo creo que le voy a usar un sticker. I'm going to use one of these stickers because it says nice, cool, great. Ooh. También dice como número uno. Le voy a poner uno. Número uno. Voy a dejar esto acá. I'm going to leave this out here. Yay. And apparently these are little bugs. Let's see here. Are these sticky bugs? <gasps> these are cute little bugs. Insectos, muy bien. Oh, mira que lindo, the caterpillar. Ok, voy a poner uno de esos. Entonces, seguimos. Um, I have glitter. Y tengo the glue. Quizás debo, debo dejar esto al lado, por si acaso. Pero eso puede, that could be very messy. Ok, I have some string. I have... Some plastic, I have some ribbon, tinta, tengo globos, I have balloons, oh my goodness, and then I have some cards, but I think I have what I need right now. ¿Tú tienes lo que tú necesitas? Yo creo que yo tengo lo que yo necesito para hacer esto, ¿ok? Entonces vamos a hacerlo juntos, super yogi! Muy bien, ahora voy a empezar con my sticker I'm going to put right here, it says number one for him and for her. It happens to be a mailman for me, so it's all good. Ooh, y mira, tiene, there's a little car. 
un carrito aquí que quizás sería, bueno, way to go. Ok, le voy a añadir eso porque es muy apropiado. It's very appropriate. Way to go. And if you notice, I have something under my paper so that I don't have a mess or draw over things, right? We don't want to make any mess or, or make sure we make, we make sure that our surroundings are taken care of. Tengo algo abajo para que no ensucie muchas cosas, ¿no? Voy a poner los ojitos, si puedo separar esto. Uy, no sé cómo separarlo. I don't know how to take off the sticker. Maybe you can help me at home. How do I do this? How do I do this, guys? I found a challenge. Tengo un reto y no lo puedo hacer. I can't do it. Oh, ¿sabes qué? You know what? I think these are glue-on eyeballs. <gasps> That would make sense. Creo que estos se tienen que pegar. Pero déjame ver si tengo unos que son más, que son para pegar. I'm going to see if these are, if they're sticky ones. Peel and stick eyeballs. Okay, vamos a usar estos entonces. We're going to use these because I don't really want to glue this. No lo quiero pegar con glue. Entonces, vamos a usar los peel and stick eyes. All right, here's one eye. Peeling. Let's see. Why, why is it peeling? Guys, no está saliendo. No entiendo que estoy haciendo mal. Voy a usar los dientes. I'm using the teeth, but don't tell your parents. No digan a tus padres. Ya, ya, ya. I got it. I think I got it, guys. This is what happens. When we have a challenge, we have to find other ways to solve it. Cuando tenemos un reto, tenemos que ver otras maneras de solucionarlo. Voy a poner los ojitos aquí. I'm going to put that one eye right there. Oh, my God. It's so cute. Let me show you. Look at how cute the eyeball. And now we're going to put the other eyeball. Otro ojo. Y ya que sé, now that I know, I don't think I need to use my teeth. No creo que necesito usar los dientes, porque los dientes no deberían estar usados. The teeth should not be used. But it's kind of hard in this scenario. Come on. Ay. Mis uñas did it. My nails did it. Ta-da! Look at the eyes! Muy bien! Very good! Okay, now I'm gonna stick the caterpillar. Voy a ponerlo. Muy bien! Acá. The little buggy, because you know they probably see buggies all the time. If they're dropping off the mail, there might be buggies or spiders in the mailbox. Quizás hay insectos. Cuando están dejando el correo, ahora voy a ponerle una. I'm going to grab another marker, marcador. There's a very big purple theme here. Ok, morado. Y le voy a escribir algo, le voy a pintar algo. I'm going to draw something for him. What do I draw? What do I draw? Que dibujo, que dibujo. Le voy a pintar un sol. I'm going to do a sun. Con un arco iris with a rainbow. Okay, so I'm going to do the sun. El sol. Can you say sun? Or sol? Muy bien. Sol. Sun. I have to... Ooh, we forgot to put the rest of the... We, do we need to put the rest of the face? Oh, we should have put the googly eyes in the sun. No. We could have put los ojos en el sol. Quizás todavía lo puedo hacer. No, no lo puedo hacer. I can't do it. They're stuck. Oh, well. Okay, we're going to try the rainbow. El arco iris ahora. Let's see. We're going to do a rainbow inside of the sun. So I got to put... El arco iris. The rainbow has red... Rojo. I hope you're doing yours too. Tiene naranja, orange, 
Oh, this is a really dark orange. Naranja. Orange. Oh, here's a better orange. Okay. That's okay. Orange. Yellow. Amarillo. Yellow. Amarillo. Verde. Oh, down here. Verde. Green. Verde. Green. Azul. Blue. Azul. Blue. Somehow this doesn't look so blue. We got it. Oh, here's a darker blue. Azul. Blue. Morado. Purple. Morado. Purple. So, tenemos rojo, red. Rojo, red. Rojo, red. Naranja, orange. Naranja, orange. Naranja, orange. Yellow. Amarillo, yellow. Amarillo, yellow. Verde. Green. Verde, green. Verde, green. Blue. Azul. Blue, azul. Blue, azul. Morado. Purple. Morado, purple. Morado, purple. We just learned the colors of the rainbow in English and in Spanish. Way to go! Primero, thank you. Gracias. And we give him the sun and the rainbow because he provides so much light and happiness for us when he brings our mail. Él nos da mucha felicidad cuando nos trae nuestro correo. Correo. Él es número uno. He is number one. Or she. Or ella. But of course, mine is my male man. He's great. Okay. So... I think that's it for me. I don't know that I want to add anything else. Do you think we have to always put everything back when we're done? Siempre tenemos que poner de vuelta lo que usamos, donde va. Esa manera, la próxima vez que lo queremos usar, está en su lugar. Next time we want to use it, it's in the right place. Because we're super yogis, super yogis, super yogis, super yogis. Na, 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 na. Okay. I think, hmm, is there anything else I want to do? Ooh, I have an idea. <gasps> ding, 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 ding. Okay, I'm going to roll this up now like a scroll. You know what scrolls are? They're like ancient papers sent through and you have it all rolled up. I don't even know how to say scroll in Spanish. I'm going to have to look that up. Hmm. Voy a tener que chequear lo que quiere decir scroll en español. Quizás tú puedes chequear también. Maybe you can check too. You know what? Let's do it together. Together we learn. Juntos aprendemos. All right, here we go. Scroll in Spanish. The beauty of Google. El rollo de papel. Bueno, eso lo sabía. Okay. El rollo, it's a roll of paper, el rollo de papel. Scroll. So now I'm going to use one of these little felt things to wrap it. You can use a string, you can use a ribbon, una cinta. Puedes usar lo que quieras, puedes usar un rubber band. Muy bien. Y le voy a poner un little circulito, un little loop-de-loop. Y ahora lo puedo poner en mi mailbox para my mailman. Para el correo, como un regalo. Like a little gift. And why do we do this? For karma yoga. Karma yoga is when you're going to give and serve to someone else and make somebody else happy. And that makes you happy too, but it's for them to be happy. 
<gasps> Isn't that great? That's amazing. So that's what we're going to do. Eso es lo que nosotros vamos a hacer. Que es karma yoga cuando uno hace algo para otra persona para hacerlos felices. Que ellos estén felices. Y quizás nosotros nos da felicidad porque ellos están felices, pero más que nada es para su felicidad. Porque sabes que van a sonreír. So my mailman is going to get this scroll and hopefully he's going to smile and be happy. Yay! So I hope you're happy because you were able to do this for someone else. If you want to give it to them now, please do so. Let them know that you are practicing karma yoga. Diles que estás practicando karma yoga. And that way you know what you're doing. Ellos saben lo que estás haciendo y es con buenas intenciones. It's with good intentions. So... Remember, guys, let's put everything back. Put it over here. <gasps> boop, boop, boop. Namaste, brave. Namaste, loving. Namaste, kind. And namaste, fun! Super yogis! Until next time. Do -do -do -do. Now, I wish I had my cape back on, but it's an internal cape. Una capa por dentro. Namaste para todos. Somos todos super yogis.